Walk Fashion Show, bringing you some of Detroit's finest. You guys should definitely check it out. The Grit. from the grid and we are here with walk fashion shows creator founder Deshaun hey, Franklin hey, I'm amazing I'm amazing co-founder my co partner my partner Crystal Roman around okay. somewhere you know we, we always crazy. acknowledge each other this this one by myself okay. like so my partner she Roman she we all working man it's, this right. is great like anytime we in this element it feels great all right teamwork makes the dream work and I definitely see the dream really working here because you got some of everybody I see the first urgent designers it was a good thing we, we saw a lot of different textures a lot of different colors a lot of different concepts so that was a really good deal so I'm excited yeah. for the second show yeah. so I know you said that you know this is your 10th year so tell me how does it feel to be here on at the 10th year <laughs> I mean it's a blessing I'm, uh, um, this is actually the, the this will be the third show today oh, so sure. we always do our walk university kids show first and then we do an emerging and then we finish with the independent but to answer the question I mean 10 years later I'm um, just watching the grow I mean we watch we always studying and trying to grow um, and, and just be that real platform for independent designers in Detroit, but just all over the country. We think about the bigger picture as well, but it's so it's so exciting to come back home. Because when we go to those different markets, we get a chance to learn, pull from New York and pull from Paris and pull from LA, and, and we pull from all those different places and we and we share that, that creative energy. And then when we come home, it's just like, it's, it's, it's just a real joy to come back to Detroit where it all started and, and to produce and, and to put out a quality product when we get here. I definitely see that quality product going out all around the world, seeing the different, you know, fashions, the different creativity and everything like that. What is it about Detroit that gives that extra uh? <laughs> Detroit just got it. We, we got our own grit. And <laughs> no pun intended. That's so funny. Right, right. <laughs> but we, we just have our own flavor. It's right. something about a Detroiter, no matter where we go. If people are well traveled and they see us move, they say y'all gotta be from Detroit. That's right. It, it's it's it, you can't really define it. It's just the confidence and the and the creativity that we have when you come from this city. It's kind of like it's it's embedded in you. You know, just just the way we move, the blue collar and the hard work and the no quit and the you know that's the fight. And I think you see that with our designers. I mean, they they have that same fighting grit in them as well you see it through their pieces through their designs and you see it through our production because we we we're not scared of anything we'll go to we'll take this we'll take this show to any city that that'll give us four walls and some lights in the runway because we know there's creatives all over the country that need that need a voice and we and we want to be that yes and I, I truly love that and i see that you know it you don't really see so much of like urban designers push forward you know I'm and it, it's amazing just to see that and just like again to see the different concepts like you said that grit that flavor that hustle and you know that Detroit has is definitely exhibited throughout the the whole event and just what you're doing as well so I definitely want to thank you for taking out this time with us I know you're a busy man I know you got to get back to everything going on this matters and I really appreciate y'all coming and supporting the movement and it I just look I'm, I'm kind of looking at the because I I still get excited so don't I'm looking. It's so diverse back here. I mean, we got people from all nationalities. All, yeah. And right now, don't nothing matter except fashion and creativity and, you know, none of that crazy stuff in the world. Right now, we all here for one cause, one purpose, and that's all pushing our dreams forward. A whole room full of dream chasers. Okay. Let's get it. Okay. Let's grit it. <laughs>
here with the proud owners of Paper Doll Couture. Tell us a little bit about your business, ladies. We're a mom and daughter team. We're at Paper Doll Couture. We're strictly online. Um, what we like to do is offer you affordable fashion. Um, with us, a doll creates her own fashion story. So we have um, pieces that are affordable and unique. We're strictly online at paperdollcouture.com on Facebook, or you can also um, find us on paperdollcouture underscore Instagram. Just follow us, and we have free shipping right now, so if you're ready to look fashionable, just give us a call. And we are here with Kari and Erica from MI Beauty Geeks. Hey, ladies, how y'all doing? Hi, how are you? Good, good. So, you know, we're here at Walk Fashion Show, and we were just saw you all and just love what you're doing. So tell the people a little bit about what's going on and your business. So MI Beauty Geeks uh, pretty much is creating a platform for anyone who's interested in cosmetology, fashion, or anything beauty to develop themselves professionally. So right now we're offering a special on our state board exam kits, and we also help um, our designers build a brand for themselves, as you can see her dress. So um, we're basically just trying to connect everyone and give people the resources they need to develop professionally. All right, cool. Sounds good. So, I'm gonna, um, how, how can, you know, people who are interested, how can they get in touch with your company? Well, you can email us at mibeautygeeks at gmail.com, or you can go to our website. It's www.mibeautygeeks.com and submit your email information, and we can follow up with you ASAP. All right. Thank you. That was, so, MI Beauty Geeks, check them out. here back at Walk Fashion Show and we are here with Alexander the artist. How you doing? I'm doing good man. How you doing man? I'm really good. I'm excited to be here. So you know I know you performed last year at the Walk uh, Fashion Show. So how does it feel to be back you know full of fame? I mean it's great energy. It feels amazing to be back. You know shout out to God. Shout out to Jelly. Shout out to everybody that's putting in work for the Walk Fashion Show. Miss Bailey. Shout out to all y'all. It's amazing man. Like Walk has always been that spark. You know, as an artist, they've helped me out a lot, always gave me that energy, you know, gave me that motivation. In Detroit, there's not a lot of different things going on, so they've always been pioneers of different, um, of, 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 you know, eclectic things and a lot of different things, so definitely enjoy them. Yeah, yeah. so that's pretty cool. So, you know, let the people know exactly, like, what it is that you do, because I hear you do some pretty dope things. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, I mean, I create sound. I represent all genres of music. I grew up listening to all genres, so I try to represent all that. Anything from Rick James to Nirvana to Coldplay to Outkast to Ross, my favorite. You, you don't know about Take Me Back to the Start. You don't even know. You why don't you even know. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Why are you, why you questioning oh, me no. like that? You know what I'm saying? It's your job to question me, I'm, but don't question saying, me like that. I'm just saying. Know. Credentials. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, nah, um, but uh, right now I got a single called Thank You. It's like a, a ode to women and love. You know, I love women and I love love. I'm infatuated with the concept of love is rare should be cherished, you know, so I think women are amazing. Y'all bear, bear life, y'all do everything. Teach us how to nurture, and we get all our game from y'all. Just think about it. You the do. first person to wear all leather outfit was not a man. Yeah, no, the first person no. to wear all red suit was for sure not a man. No, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so that part. The first person to wear their hair like this was probably not a man. No, you know yeah, that, that so part, women, you know. You know yeah, and, thank and you, things. okay, yeah. thank you so much. So, you know, you're out here, you're doing some good, big things for the city of Detroit, you know, representing. Right. So tell us, you know, what's going on, what's com got coming up, how can people get in touch with you? Okay, well, I'm on Instagram at What's Up AZ. Music is available on um, all streaming platforms, Apple Music, Spotify, uh, Metro Time. Shout out to you guys for all showing love. Uh, shout out to everybody who's uh, worked with me so far. Um, who else am I? I've been in Source Magazine. Okay, I just cool. did South by Southwest. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Austin. Shout out to uh, Peace Paint Poetry. You know what I'm saying? Out in Austin. Love, love. Yeah. So. All right. That's what I'm talking about. All right. So thanks again, Alexander. We look forward to working with you and seeing more of the artists out definitely, here definitely. coming through. All well, love, y'all. I appreciate it. See, this is love right here. You know what I'm saying? All love. We're here at the Walk Fashion Show. My name is Seven.
to the Fly Tie Experience coming October 13th. Flyers will be coming soon. Hey, make sure you follow the grit. Hey.